Hey, buddy. Um, I know you don't give a shit about Gunnam ringing you, but don't forget he's supposed to be coming on tour with us next week. So uh, that's what's been put in the email. So you might want to make <laughs> at least contact with him because he doesn't return my calls. Um, otherwise, we're going to need to remove Gunnam from the bill. Uh, yeah, man, that sounds like a cool day. Um, so, yes, all right, cool. Um, I'll, I didn't even connect that Gunnam was coming with us next week. I forgot all about it. So I think we haven't heard from him since the Thursday. I didn't even think that he was on the bill. So, um, um, man, I, I, he's, he sent me a text and said, um, sorry to hear you cook. I'll deal with Mark. I'll, I'll call him now or something. So, yeah, I don't know why the fuck he doesn't return your calls. It pisses me off. But anyway, um, I will make the effort to uh, touch base with him today. Um, yes, if you. Hey, mate, I just thought I'd try you. I spoke to Gunnam, so um, I don't know what the fuck's going on with Gunnam. So he wants to have a face-to-face -face chat with me tomorrow, he said, if he's up on the up on the Gold Coast. And I said, yes, that's fine, man, if you're around. I said, just, he said, can I call you back a bit later? I said, fine, but I'm going to fucking get tests and shit. And I said, call Mark. And he was like, well, no, nah, I want to have a face-to-face -face chat with you. And I'm like, oh, for fuck's sake. So obviously he's got an issue. And I said, well, are you coming away next week? And what's the go, man? You know, I said, are you coming on tour with us what's the what's happening is well i want to come up to the gold coast tomorrow and have a face to face i said right all right so mate my thought is he's got the shits about something and yeah well he's not coming away so i would suggest that uh, um it's going to be a no show but you know i won't know until tomorrow i guess will i so all right dude um yeah that's the update well, if he is a no-show, mate, we need to fucking cane him because it's fucking bullshit. We sat with him and Kiara, Kiana, whatever her name is, and he agreed and we shook hands and I lent him a hundred bucks and he can go and fuck himself. Honestly, I'm sick of people being so inconsistent and moody and all the carry on, mate. So anyway, I'll leave that in your capable hands. And if he's got the shits with me, he can fucking take it up to my face. It may be such a fucking pussy like that, honestly. Even he and Jerry, mate, why well, just go and face go face to face and just fucking sort it out? But he doesn't. He, he's like every other little weak cunt. Does does all the bickering and and whinging behind people's backs. Anyway, let's hope that's not what it is. It's just something personal, uh, but not not with me because, mate, we've extended a lot of gratitude his way and uh, offered to help him with websites and uh, coming to live on the land. You know, and he's got to stop his bullying ways and then and then run at home like a little fucking four-year-old girl when uh, when people go, hey, that's not how it works. <laughs> anyway, um, all right, I'll, uh, I'll try, mate, it's fucking heaving down down here. I can only do like 60 kilometers an hour. It's that heavy. I mean, yeah, I agree totally. Fuck, I mean, if, <laughs> if he has a fucking Winge at me, I'm going to say, so, yeah, same thing. So we've offered to do your website for free. We've offered to fucking um, set up your foundation for free. So straight away, there's like five grand's worth of fucking stuff there for you. Gunner Mark gave you a hundred bucks out of his own pocket the other day when we're sitting there and he's, this, he's living in a fucking caravan like you are. We fucking, we told you we'd put you on a retainer and offered you a house and land package on the other block that Mark and I are directors of the company that has control of or we can get you onto the community, which would be a vote because it's a community. I'm fucking struggling to see what the issue is where you feel unwelcome. And I mean, the fact that Melissa, who is a cunt, by the way, um, was a cunt to you, but it's highly fucking surprising that an old woman like that fucking offended you. And I'm so I, I don't know what more we could have fucking done or said. Um, you know, we're paying you to come on fucking uh, tour with us. Like, what, what more do we need to do? Do, to prove that we're your fucking biggest supporters. So that's the conversation I'm going to have. And if you still got an issue, I'm say, what do I, I don't know what to say. Well, you know, I don't know where else to go from there. So anyway, fuck it. I'm, um, um, yeah, I'm over all the shit as well. He's just going to have that fucking conversation and it'll be finished one way or the other after that, I guess.